Where is it? 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 What is happening? I can't find my monkey. My monkey, Parker. I can't. I can't. It's. It's. It's not here. It's not here. It's okay. not anywhere. Okay. 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 When's the last time you saw it? Um. Um. Last night. Uh. We were cuddling. That's. That's the last time we saw it. Okay. Um. You. And then I woke up and I went to breakfast and I came back and it was. All right. Was I'm trying to process what's happening right. Okay. You're. You lost your monkey. Yes. From yes. between last night and now, and you I can't, can't find it. it. I can't find it. And you absolutely. I've seen it. I. You need your monkey. I need it. I need okay. it. I can't go to well, sleep. Well, I'll tell you this. It. Hey, Jake, take a breather. Okay. Every time that I've lost something, I can never find it. Uh, so I need someone to help me. Oh. So like you a need a professional searcher. Okay. Is what well, you need. who do you think I? Hello. Does somebody need some help? Have you lost something? Uh, yeah, I have actually. Hmm. I, I did Let me ask some... you some questions. Okay. What does Teddy look like? Oh, well, it's actually... Oh, it's a monkey, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it, it is a monkey. Hmm. And, uh, okay, how tall is it? Oh, well, I'd say... 16 a... inches? I, I think that's actually exactly of course how, it how is. tall it is. Yes, okay, the color. Well, the color is kind of... Oh, burnt sienna. Let me put that down. I was just going to say brown, but uh, yeah, What does I it guess... smell like? Oh, it, oh, it kind of smells, oh yes, like freshly cut grass mixed with dandelions on an 85 degree summer day. It, mm -hmm. Wow, that is so much better than what I was going to say. Yeah. But, I knew it. But yeah, yep. that, I think that describes it perfectly. That's all I need. Thank you. Uh, oh, okay. I think she's going to go find your monkey. I hope so. Oh, cool. uh, baby, look oh. at this sparkler. That's, Can you believe somebody lost this? Oh a, my gosh, it's that's nice, mine. It's nice oh, ring. I got these little clickety clackety teeth. How do you like these? Those, I mean, they're great. I mean, yeah, they're, they're cool. <laughs> Ooh, Jake, look at this. What? My favorite soda. Yeah. Oh, that was good. Oh, oh cool. Wait, here's the. This is the best one. This is the best one, guys. You're gonna love this. You want some jelly beans? I, I, these, yeah, yeah I like jelly beans. These were so perfect. Miss Wait. Miss Kelly, did oh. did you? That's all great, but did you find my monkey? Oh well. Uh... Uh. Wait. Okay. Okay. I got it. I got something for you. Oh. Yes, I do, Jake. I've got something for you. Ta da! Uh, this, this 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 isn't my. All right, guys. This is a camel. But look, it's brown. Doesn't this is, it work? Yeah, he's not a bird. Guys, Santa. guys, guys, guys. Uh, Kelly, I. Uh. I think it was a, a good gesture to go try and find his monkey, but I think maybe you got your priorities mixed up a little bit. And maybe you didn't. Yeah, I was remember. distracted. I was distracted. So how about we check out this Bible story and see maybe how it could help us? Okay. It's Bible story time. Hey Jake, don't worry, I have a story for us. What's up Camp Upstreet? My name is Gideon and this summer we're going to be talking about what it means to follow Jesus. Now following Jesus means doing stuff like Jesus did and thinking and teaching the way that Jesus did. And Jesus loved to tell stories. One of his favorite stories that he told uh, was a story about a shepherd. And uh, this shepherd had a hundred sheep. That's a lot of sheep. And the thing about the hundred sheep is that he had to count them pretty often. Uh, I have a couple of sheep right here. That's kind of an example. Uh, he was counting them and he was 
97, 98, 99, but he was missing one. Now, come on, he has 99 sheep left. He doesn't need to find that last one, right? I mean, he already has so many, but Jesus, who is the good shepherd, loved that one sheep, and he knew that the other 99 sheep were safe. And so even though he had 99 other sheep, he went out and searched everywhere until he could find that one last sheep. I, I had one around here somewhere. Uh, I don't know where it went. Oh, I found him. And see, Jesus loved that sheep enough to go out and find him, even though he already had 99 sheep. And you know what? I bet the other 99 sheep saw that and thought that he would do the exact same thing for them if they were ever lost. And so it's important to remember that in our lives, that last sheep might be someone that is kind of hard to love. Uh, it might be someone that's really rude to us whenever we're talking with them, or uh, maybe it's someone that makes fun of us or thinks that they're the best at something when they're really not. Jesus asks us to love them anyway, though. Uh, if we're trying to follow Jesus, Jesus always talked about how we need to love one another, just like how the shepherd loved that one sheep. That's all that we got for our story. Let's go ahead and pray. God, thank you so much for sending Jesus down. I pray that you would help us to love one another just like the shepherd loved that one sheep. Thank you, God. In your name we pray. Amen. Bye. Wow, that's a really great story, guys. It sure was. Yep. Mm -hmm. I think, well, maybe I was a little distracted. Yeah. That's okay. I mean, it was Sorry. still a really good story. I mean, I loved how the, the shepherd was focused on just finding the one lost sheep, you know? Mm -hmm. I thought that was really cool. He was paying attention. Yeah, <laughs> it was a it was a great example of that shepherd. He loved that sheep so much that he went out of his way and stayed super focused to make sure that he was found. And it makes me think of a question, right? Mm -hmm. How can you show that you love someone this week? I, you know, that, that really mm -hmm. is a great question. Maybe... You know what, Jake? You know what? I should have focused more on just the monkey. If I had maybe looked in the right spot and really had my eyes open, yeah, I don't know. That's not your uh, fault. What? Just... what? Hold on! Oh my goodness! Is this your monkey? He looks like he's 16 inches to me! Yes! George! <laughs> what are you doing, buddy? <laughs> yes. oh, I can sleep tonight. Oh, thank did. you, Kelly. You're welcome. Oh, that was so great. Oh. What a happy ending. <laughs> yes. We found the monkey, and Kelly ultimately was able to show Jake love by helping find his monkey this week. I focus that time. Focus. So, guys, make sure this week you go out and do your best to show love to someone this week. And we'll see you guys next time on the Sunday Fun Day Show. Bye.